good news. My Apple productivity course has been updated and is now available to all of you who have enrolled in the Apple course. Completely free update for anyone who's enrolled. If you're not enrolled, you can join the course at any time and every year you will get the free update as Apple changes. So what's new in this year's course? Well, let me tell you. Apple has largely been focused on a cosmetic change, but that's given me the opportunity to completely update the Apple Reminders, Apple Notes and Calendar sections of the course. They are completely new, I've updated them, brought in some of the new features that have come out over the last couple of years, and they are phenomenal. I'm sure you're gonna get a lot out of that and learn a lot of ways to be able to organize your productivity system within the Apple ecosystem. Plus, you also get lessons on COD, that's collect, organize, and do, and the time sector system. And in the reminders section of the course, I am showing you how to set up reminders to use the phenomenal time sector system. Plus this year, I put a couple of videos in on Apple's Freeform because it is a phenomenal planning tool that can be used across all your devices. Now I should point out that in this course, I have focused mainly on showing you Mac OS 26, but everything that I show you in this course is completely compatible across all your devices, whether you're using the iPad or the iPhone. This is a phenomenal course that will give you a solid set of productivity tools that you don't have to pay subscriptions for, that you don't have to buy because they come built in with your operating system. So I hope you enjoy the course. It's available now to all of you who are already enrolled. If not, you can take advantage and join the course right now, knowing that every year I will give you a free update. So please enjoy the course and I hope to see you on the other side.